Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, everyone. Happy. I was about to say Friday, Lord. Today is Monday. And we are so grateful to be alive on today. Say good morning, Brooke. It's Monday. But I'll, just because it's Monday, it doesn't mean that we can't have a great attitude. Right, Brooke? Anyway, we are going to have a phenomenal week. We are going to decree and we are going to, de to declare that early, set it in the atmosphere because this week is going to be great. Um, this week is Easter, so it's a lot of things that's happening this week with a lot of people. Uh, Oh, that glass, they need to, oh, that might not be glass. Oh, excuse me. I went to the gym early this morning. I'm so glad I did because it's something about when I go to the gym in the morning, I don't know, comment down below if you can, if you can attest to this as well. But when I go in the morning, it just makes my morning and my day that much greater as far as like how I'm feeling how my energy and how everything kind of flows with me for it throughout the day. So I am super excited that I got up on time. I know that sun. I got up on time and I went to the gym. I spent about maybe, maybe 45 minutes in the gym this morning. Um, I didn't record because I just didn't. I don't have a reason, no rhyme or reason. I just didn't record. But I was so glad. I feel amazing. Um, I hope that you all have an amazing week as well. Speak it to the atmosphere. Speak it to the, decree it and declare it that you're going to have an amazing day, an amazing week, an amazing month, an amazing rest of the year whatever trials whatever tribulations whatever test that comes you are going to make it you are going to survive and all of the above right so that is you know that is big with me um about dec decreeing and declaring things and putting it in the atmosphere that it will be so right start eating your breakfast babe so you'll have time. So this past weekend, I did do some spring cleaning. Um, I recorded it on my actual camera. Now let me tell you about my camera. I'm not really used to it. So I did do some recording in the, when I did some, some things in the kitchen and some things in my family room. Uh, so now I just have, I, I have to kind of figure out how I can, I know it's, I know it's easy, but I got to convert it with the cord on the laptop and then upload it. But I did do exactly what I said I was going to do. I didn't do a whole lot of spring cleaning because I actually hired someone that's going to come this week, this Saturday and she is going to um, help me organize, kind of help me do some really deep, deep cleaning. Um, I'm not gonna put her, well, I'm gonna ask her, but I don't think I'm gonna put her on camera, but I am going, I do want to show you guys some before and after footage of how I am uh, setting up my home for the spring and summer. Um, a lot of things are getting ready to take place. I want to get new, a new patio uh, set. So I want to do that and kind of have my patio already set for the, the rest of the spring and summer months. So let's go ahead and say a word of prayer. Heavenly Father, we come to you this morning, Lord God, to tell you thank you. Thank you, Lord, for waking us up this morning and starting us on our way, God. 
God, we thank you for grace and mercy, God, that you have afforded us each morning, this morning, Lord God, when we woke up. God, I ask and I plead to you, God, that you would forgive us of any sins that we may have committed, anything that we have said or thought or did that was not pleasing to you, God. We pray and we ask for your forgiveness, God. God, I ask that you will be with us as we're traveling back and forth to and fro, Lord God, to schoolhouses, workplaces, to the stores, to wherever we may be at on today, Lord God, whatever we have going on, Lord God, I pray and I ask for your covering, God. Dispatch your guardian angels around our children, Lord God, around all of our loved ones, Lord God, all of our friends, even our foes, Lord God. We ask that you would bless and keep each and every one of them, Lord God. God, I say a special prayer, Lord God, for our children. There is so much going on in this world, Lord God. There is so much bullying. There is so much meanness that's going on in this world, God. So, God, I pray and I ask, Lord, that you would touch the hearts of these children, touch their hearts and their minds, that they would know how to be nice and kind to each other, Lord God. That they would know how to treat each other, Lord God, just as though they would want to be to be uh, treated, God. So, God, I pray a special prayer in the name of Jesus that you would touch even the hearts and the minds of the parents, Lord God, to instill in children to be nice and to be kind and to not be bullying, Lord God. We come against the spirit of bullying in the name of Jesus. We cast it back to the pits of hell where it was created. And we decree and we declare on this day that we will have these children that will get along. There's no more fighting, no more bickering, no more killings, Lord God. We pray and we ask in the name of Jesus, God. Lord, I know that you can do anything but fail. So God, as I come boldly to your throne on this morning, we come against it right now in the name of Jesus, that they will know how to learn, know how to get along with each other, God, that they would just know how to just be nice and kind human beings. We come against it in the name of Jesus, any type of disruption, any type of drama, Lord God, we come against it in the name of Jesus. We plead the blood of Jesus over these children on today, God. And it is so. God, we thank you. We praise you. We honor you. We glorify you. In the name of Jesus. Bring unity. Bring love. Genuine love, God. We ask for it now. God, we thank you. God, we love you. We honor you. And we adore your name. And it is in Jesus' name we pray. Thank God and amen. You guys know what is next. Go and make it a great day. Keep praying, keep pushing, keep pushing, and definitely keep praying. It is going to get greater later. We're going to decree and we're going to declare that over our lives for the entire year of 2024 and for the rest of our lives. Whatever it is that we are going to face, we're not alone because God is always going to be with us, right? So until next time, don't forget to... Turn on your bell notification so that you will not miss another video from me, your girl, Candace with Candace H Creations and my little rookie cookie. Keep praying, keep pushing, you guys. I love you guys with the agape love, and I will see you guys in my next video on tomorrow, Tuesday. Talking Tuesday. We're gonna get broke to talk. Yeah right sweets <laughs> okay you guys see you later